I'm Malcolm Brooks, and I'd like to look at step seven of the documentary songwriting method. Perform the song in a recording or a live setting. I'd like to explore the question, how do I make a groove when I play only one instrument and there's no band, there's just me? Well, a groove is a combination of sounds and patterns, of course. And I'd like to explore the idea of playing the space so that I play my instrument, in this case, my student cello, but I also play the space, the sound or absence of it between the notes. Here, I play the sound by plucking. I play the space by putting my fingers back on the string. If it were a keyboard, down go the fingers, there's the sound, up go the fingers to play the space. First, a pattern in 4-4 four, four with no space. Now let's add some space on 2 and 4, those two beats. Now let's see if we can add some upbeats where the spaces occur on rests. Feeling pretty good. Feels like a groove. We could get extremely complex spaces on rests that are a quarter note long, eighth note long, sixteenth note long, but we have to sing while we play these patterns. Let's see if I can sing as I play that pattern. We'll take the third verse of Anna's song about her dad returning from Afghanistan. The verse about, oh, making the basketball team. I've been playing lots of basketball, made it on the team. Hope he'll come see me play, and I wonder what we'll make for dinner. Could use a little more practice, but pretty good. Now, Adding spaces, they can be added on the upbeats as we just did, but they can also be added on the downbeats. And here's an example. I could go on for days. I love to do this. I hope you enjoy it too, and I hope it helps you create a groove with just one instrument, and I hope you enjoy Step 7.